event underway. Trevor Peak, David Robbins. It's time. Welterweight title. Aries Fight Series on the line. Let's go to the cage. Our cage announcer, Jeff Hobbs. <laughs> Let's go, man. Please help me welcome to the cage, Trevor Peak. Peak chance moments ago. Huge reaction for the popular Trevor Peak. Undefeated at 3 0 and 1. Three straight wins after opening with a no contest that he was in control of, and then a low blow and an end of the fight ruined the start. But man, Trevor Peak has been dominant against high level competition ever since. The power and the O in the L column. He is at the slightest of underdogs. <laughs> Just very slight. It's a virtual pick him. But Trevor Peak is ready to go. We talked to him in the pre fight out of now Agogi Combatives, originally from Pisgah, Alabama, now in that Agogi Combatives camp. And man, he's the current AFC 170 pound champ. He's a two time 170 pound amateur champ as well. He finished his fights, big time power. What a display we're going to see tonight from Trevor Peak. Man. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> It is go time. Oh, man. <laughs> and that man, there he go. <laughs> Trevor Peak. One half of the main event. Getting the opportunity to compete for the Aries Fight Series 170 title. And, man, this fight is epic in all facets of the game. Uh, he is ready. He is ready to go. Um, you know, the final hugs, the final love before he's getting ready to step into battle for war. Uh, he has a lot of people from Alabama all here, man. A lot of his family, a lot of his friends. Uh, in his corner, he got Sterling Peace, Jeff Powell, uh, Logan Neal. Uh, man, this is this fight is all the way around. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> so from a strategy standpoint, man. talk about it one by one. What's the strategy for Trevor Peak? What is gonna be important for him? to get the W against the uh, accomplished David Robbins. All right, my keys to victory for yep. Trevor Peak is to keep the fight on the feet. Keep the fight on the feet, constantly stay moving. Do not be in exchanges with David where it's tit for tat. Be smart about your exchanges. But if you do see the kill, go forward. Um, because I do feel like Trevor meanness, grit, determination, it's just a little bit more than what David can bring to the table. We'll come back to that. Talk about David's keys to victory. Here's Jeff. And now, please help me welcome to the cage his opponent, David Robbins. David Ruthless Robbins. He's the head coach at his camp at American Killer Bees, now in Somerset, Kentucky. Been through so much in his personal life two years away from the sport but he is back and looking to show that he is better than ever and david robbins what an opportunity he has but what a tough opponent he has in front of him robbins four years older than trevor p two inches taller the weight it's only a pound but it's massive because trevor p can win the inaugural Aries Fight Series Welterweight Championship. Because David Robbins is one pound over 171, he is ineligible for that belt. He said he's rehydrated to about 185 pounds. We'll see how, what Trevor Peak rehydrated to and how they look in the cage. But keys to victory for David Robbins, Taurus. Keys to victory for David Robbins. Do not allow Trevor Peak to get inside. And if any facet of the game, if David ever gets in trouble, get the fight to the ground to where you have the advantage. I do believe David advantage in the jiu-jitsu area can give him certain advantages over Trevor Peak that where he can potentially submit him. Now, I don't know if he can submit him because that would be a hard thing to do out of Trevor Peak, but it's not impossible. And I feel like, man, David is in the game. He just got slapped by his corner he this game is oh my goodness oh my goodness 
Uh, his corner is in his face. His corner is trying to get him ready because he knows he's about to get in there with a dog. This is a dog type fight. This fight is not meant for the weak minded. You got to be ready to go. You got to be ready to fight. <laughs> I am ready for this fight. Oh my goodness. The, man, the moment this fight was announced, I was like, I cannot miss it. I cannot miss it. This is going to be one of the best fights. This already, with just the build up in itself, this could be the fight of the freaking year for every fight series already. We've already had strikes landed in the second inspection zone, isn't even done yet. They do touch gloves briefly on the way around for David Robbins, who got slapped in the inspection zone by his corner. All right, Trevor Peak, black trunks, blue glove tape with a Death stare across the cage. David Robbins, he's got the Jaws <laughs> shark trunks with the black, green, red, and American Ladies flag and under gentlemen. shorts as well in the red glove tape. This <laughs> next bout of the evening is sponsored by Action 24 7. Action 24-7, Tennessee's only local legal sports book tied by Tennesseans for Tennesseans. <laughs> this next bout of the evening for one gentleman, Mr. Trevor Peak, is for the Aries Professional Welterweight Championship. It is scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Your first fighter, fighting out of the Allure Properties Blue Corner. He has a record of three wins with no losses. He weighed in at an even 170 pounds. He is now representing a Gogi Combatives out of Chattanooga, Tennessee, and representing Pisgah, Alabama. Cotton Eye Joe, this is Trevor P. Now his opponent, fighting out of the Knoxville Mortgage Brokers Red Corner. He has a professional record of seven wins with no losses. He weighed in at 171 pounds. As always, he is representing the American Killer Bees from Somerset, Kentucky. This is David Ruthless Robbins. Gentlemen, this crowd has waited all night. Let's bring it in the middle and make this thing official. All right, gentlemen, we went over the rules in the back. I want a good, clean fight. I want you to protect yourselves at all times. Obey my commands at all times. Touch them up, back to your corners. Cut, not Joe. Put your phones down. Don't record our live stream, and I promise you, you want to watch this with your own two eyes. Let's get it on. You don't want to miss this, baby. <laughs> It is main event time, Aries Fight Series here at the Cotton Eye Joe in Knoxville. Welterweight Championship on the line. Pete can win it, Robbins cannot, they touch gloves, and we are underway. Five, five minute rounds, pro MMA. Live on SpectationSports.com. Jimmy Neely, our referee, I'm Vince Ferrar, alongside Torres Finney. What a main event and a build up for this one. Get inside leg kick there from Trevor. Oh, good catch, oh, good right, there you go. Trevor's, Trevor's looking good, staying to the game plan a little bit. David moving around. Oh, good head kick there from Trevor. Didn't get all the way flush. Oh! Oh, oh my over. God! What? Over. Oh, oh well, God. it's over. Oh Trevor Peak, a first round knockout of David Robbins. Spectacular fashion. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wow. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Oh. It is over. Oh. Trevor Peak delivered on his power in dominating fashion over 
a tremendous fighter in David Roberts. Greg Hopkins <laughs> witnessed to it early on. I'm sorry, guys. You know that I've fought Trevor. You know that I've trained with David. I wanted to get over here for this fight to commentate, but I couldn't get over the crowd. was so stacked, I couldn't get through. Holy moly, what a deal. Trevor Peak with a first round finish over over David Robbins. Let's see if there's this pretty great fight here. As you can look, and Trevor keeps timing this head kick right there, and then he keeps throwing that overhead right right there. He eventually connects with it. David's backing up right here, and you can see that clint, that clock right here. Boom. David drops. Trevor jumps on, gets in there to finish the fight. You have your new champion right here in Aries wow. Fight Series right here. The first ever Aries Fight Series champion is Trevor Peak from Agoge Combatives, Greg Hopkins camp, and Torres Finney's camp. Wow. Guys, the magnitude of this fight. Yeah. Wow. Who wasn't watching? Who isn't standing in this in this <laughs> whole complex right now? Everybody is still on their feet right now because no matter what happens in this fight, you win, you get noticed, okay? You get noticed, you get eyes on you. David Robbins had that opportunity there at a uh, contender series with me. Uh, I'm sorry, from Alaska, me, uh, medic right there from Alaska had that opportunity. Two years down, Trevor Peak, the fire still burning in that young man, 26 years old, now 4-0 with a title coming in. Who's going to stop this man? Let's get him somebody out there. Yeah, Come who, on. Who, who's going to want to fight him? And that's another thing that's going to be difficult. I mean, Demir. I mean, how cool would, would Demir versus Trevor be? That would be Dude, a fight. I'm yeah. telling you, that man, I don't fight. know many folks that's want to fight that man, Trevor Peak, right now. All right. It's time to make it official, and this place is going to erupt once again when Jeff Hobbs does, and the belt is handed over. Let's go to the cage. Here is Jeff Hobbs. Ladies and gentlemen at home watching on SpectationSports.com, Cut Night Joe. Your referee stops this bout at 32 seconds of the very first round. Your winner by knockout and new Aries welterweight champion, Trevor <laughs> Peak. <laughs> wow, Trevor Peak is the Aries Fight Series welterweight champ, the 